With free water stations at four locations in Salem, the city and public hope a batch of test results Saturday will give the all clear. In the meantime, an algae bloom at Detroit Lake, the source of Salem's drinking water, has made water in the city unsafe for young children and vulnerable people. We were not taking the weekend off. We were not withholding information that was during a special city council meeting today, city manager Steve Powers tried to explain why leaders waited four days through the holiday weekend to warn the public. He said they were waiting for more test results, and then he apologized. We were doing all of this to try to maintain a safe and healthy water supply, to maintain public confidence, and to have the exact opposite happen is, is very painful for, for me and for staff, and, and I, I apologize for that. City council members were outraged. And certainly in my ward in East Salem, we have a lot of vulnerable residents, and uh, I think we failed them. During a meeting that stretched on for three hours, they let staff know what it was like being kept in the dark themselves as panic spread after the warning that the water may not be safe. And the teacher looked at me and said, can we drink the water? And I said, I don't know. I, I'm not seeing any communication on my part. And she said, well, if it's not safe for kids, I wonder if it's safe for me. City staff admitted the first messages were only in English, angering advocates who said 20 different languages are spoken in the Salem area. Counselors also questioned why the city used a lab in the Midwest, creating a delay in getting results. Neither the city of Salem nor the Oregon Health Authority sought out another lab that could potentially analyze our sampling. Tonight, the warning remains. Do not drink Salem's water if you are in a vulnerable population or under the age of six. There are four free water stations set up around the city of Salem. Yesterday, they said about 400 people took advantage, and then today they said there's a steady stream of those. We have a list of those locations at KGW.com.